Shalom there everyone. So today we look at the Mobula 8 DJI O3 and this is the highly anticipated one. I've been waiting for this for a while now. It looks to be physically really really good. Right, do note that this is a beta version so the canopy here that you see is a 3D printed one. The actual product will be a molded canopy and that one will be a lot sturdier and less flexy than this one. Alright, so the Mobula 8 itself is just basically a standard Mobula 8 except for the fact that the flight controller is with the crazy F405 HD and this one is to support all the HD systems and the receiver itself is the Express LRS V3 and this is the UWAT receiver unlike the SPI receiver on the analog Mobula 8. Right, so the weight of this quad goes in at about 82 grams and with the lipo that i'm using this is the 380 milliamp lipo it is at 103.56 okay so she's a little chunky but i think she is capable of some aerobatic maneuvers uh, do note that there are several types of lipos sizes out there so make sure that the one that you get is the one that fit onto the battery tray and of course the higher milliamp ones are the ones that will give you a slightly longer flight time so do take note of that of course before any flight you know do check that everything is secured the canopy and nothing is shaking nothing is vibrating and I will not go into the details of binding the um, air unit or binding of the Express LRS. I think there are many videos out there that has already explained it. So if you do need some assistance, uh, just you know, I'll, I'll put the links in the description box down below. So I'm going to be flying with the goggles V2 and there's a couple of things that you need to take note of like a firmware update, routing your goggles or maybe WTF OS, compatibility with the O3 air unit and the Vista. Also if you were to be flying on the goggles too then it's just a plug and play. Before doing any firmware flashing I would suggest and recommend that you check, check and check before doing any flashing or up updating you don't want to end up with goggles that are you know useless so do take note of that i'll put links in the description box down below so do check that out see you on the field okay so the mobula 8 dji 03 has been set up everything's done and you know flying it in stock configuration i'm excited i mean this is something that um, we've been waiting for the the, the last DJI VTX that Happy Model has was the Crux 35. So this is the next step that Happy Model has taken. And yeah, <sighs> let's see how she flies. note that this is the direct DVR from the air unit as well as the goggles and that there are no uh, gyro flow done onto the video clip neither do I have any color grading or color correction done to this video
the, the footage is really awesome. On a 380mm LiPo, it's, it took me about uh, 2 minutes 43 seconds for like just normal cruising. But with some really hard flying, it's like about a minute-ish. So you might want to get like slightly bigger LiPos, but you know, that's it, it just gets a little heavier. But all in all, I, I think the video quality, it's really really good. Um, the, of course, this is the beta version, so... Um, there's still like tons of work to be done on this before it's released to the public. Of course, we need to make sure that this is all good before you got it. I think, yeah, I have a little like vibrations from the, the PIDs. Uh, that needs to be tuned out a little. All in all, this is not too bad. I'm loving this. All right, so the rain is coming. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that video if you're liking the content So please do help to give a like and subscribe and I really appreciate it a lot. Thank you all for watching and see you guys again soon Ciao